Well, I knew the Argos were going to suck this year, but I didn't believe it was going to be this bad. Another blown opportunity for the Boatmen last week against BC. Now, I can understand them not put, uh, like putting up the points by field goals. I'm mean, like, Medlock was money last week, going 7-for-7, seven seven, tying a team record. But when you have all those opportunities, it signifies that you're not being able to punch the ball into the end zone. The Argos had tons of opportunities, and they pretty much coughed it up in the second half. I don't know where their defense was. They completely fell asleep. And that punt return where they tried to do a lateral, and it was picked off during the lateral and run back to the house for the winning touchdown on the last play of the game, I'm going, what the hell are you thinking? Now, granted, I'm not as big an Argo fan as I as I used to be, but still, this team is terrible. It reminds me of the 1981 Double Blues squadron where they won, I think it was only like two, three games, but then the next season they turned around and made it all the way to the, to the Cup. But still, this is abysmal. Bart Andrus, shape up your guys. Otherwise, you're not going to be lasting as head coach of the Argos for very long. And it's just an embarrassment. Granted, it's great for us Ticat fans, but still, for the tried and true Argo fans, this is an ab abominable season. And quite frankly, if they were concerned about losing fans now, after this, they're going to be going away in droves. So, basically, I hope the Argos turn the season around, but still, this is becoming a really bad season. So I hope they figure that what's going on, turn it around. They've been known to turn it around the second half and come back, but quite frankly, they need a lot of work. I'm Deef Man, and that's my view from the outside.